Welcome back. So, the volcano known as Santorini in Greece is having an earthquake swarm, possibly related to volcanic activity. It could be gearing for another eruption, first of its kind since 1950, apparently. Um, but also, this volcano is notorious for having the, one of the largest Plinian, Plinian eruptions during the past 10,000 years, which likely sparked the Atlantis legend. So... And new earth, yeah, and new, yeah. A new earthquake swarm is occurring near the volcanic island. Since Tuesday, January 28th of 2025, more than 130 quakes of magnitudes up to around three have been detected in a broad cluster of epicenters about 25 kilometers northeast of the island, located at depths between. 25 and 5 kilometers. The strongest tremors could be felt on the island, especially in the northernmost areas near the town of Oya. The location of the earthquake suggests that they are caused by tectonic or volcano tectonic activity along the node. <sighs> Kimini or Columbos fault lines which run parallel southwest to northeast through the center of the caldera and along a chain of submerged volcanic cones to the northeast, including the infamous active Columbus volcano 8 kilometers northeast of Santorini. Volcanic activity in the past 400,000 years, including all historical activity, have been from vents located along these liniments. The current... Seismic activity, however, reminds without a doubt of the volcanic crisis that affected Santorini during 2011 to 2012, which probably didn't help with the end of the world of 2012 scandals. Back then, a shallow magma intrusion, as was confirmed later, occurred under the caldera and caused hundreds of small quakes along with increasing degassing and temperature rises at the famous hot springs near Nia and Pelia Kamini, as well as up to 12 kilometers horizontal expansion of the caldera itself, which was later measured with satellite radar data. The intrusion did not evolve into an eruption, and everything calmed down again, but there has been a serious risk of a volcanic eruption during this time, Something that would have caught authorities very unprepared back then. A much denser network of monitoring, along with emergency plans, were reportedly put into action as a result of that crisis. It is too early to say, but the t time might have come to put some of this to a test. Is volcanic activity the cause? Whether the current episode is a repeat of 2011 to 2012, i.e. volcanic in origin or only result of local tectonic activity, remains uncertain, unless other data can confirm the involvement of magma at depth, but at least should be taken as a potential scenario. In that case, it would most likely involve the submarine Columbus volcano, which is closer to the earthquakes than Santorini itself. A local newspaper mentioned that a meeting between representatives of government bodies and scientists monitoring the volcano have has taken place, and that according to the Ministry of Climate Crisis and Civil Protection, there's no reason for particular concern, at least until now. It has been argued that at least during the 2011-2012 to 2012 crisis, authorities tended to downplay the volcanic risk when it affected highly touristic areas such as Santorini in order to not alarm the public and to safeguard the extremely important tourist industry of the island. Ranked as one of the most tourist destination, the top tourist destinations worldwide, with the succession of record-breaking holiday seasons in the past few years, where the current situation will be handled differently with more data along with unbiased scientific interpretation accessible to the public will be interesting to see and yeah that is true um but yeah that does seem to be it for right now with this setup with this 
system here. But um, as you see with the graph here, though, with the map, yeah, it's mostly with Kulimbo, but there's also been earthquakes at Santorini. So both are seem to be acting up. So it is something to watch. Current status, restless, 2 out of 5. Because of this, it was raised to yellow because of this activity. And Kalimbo will probably have that same fate. So, um, but yeah. But as is, that does seem to be it for right now. Stay safe out there. See you in the next video.